Okay, so let me mix this blue. Let's see what happens. There you go. Look, it's ready. Can you see it? Now I'm gonna apply it. And of course, the light is coming from here. So this top, it's gonna be kind of dark, all right? So I'm trying to think if the light is coming from here, what it's really in the dark spot so that I blocking the first shapes so that I have my three dimensional effect very fast. And after that, I will go into detailing. Okay. Okay. Now I'll, I'll hit again. Okay. And after I'll spray fix. Remember that the secret of this technique, just like on Photoshop, is that you have a very nice shading. A, a, a shading that goes from dark to light in a very well done way. If it's uh, not well done, you have stripes and that's bad. So let's see if I'm capable to do it. I'm very light, eh? I'm not forcing too much. I'm just following the shape. I'm feeling that shape. <clears throat> and here I do a few details to make sure that we have a uh, Okay, now that I did that, I will just make some, a uh, little bit of the shading on the side because of course the side also has some shading. Okay, so this is my base, okay? I should buy a brush. Okay, let's spray fix. Okay, so look, already you can see very, very uh, straight, you know, very clearly what is in shadow and what it's having light. So that's the most important thing. You see, it's really, it's got flat. So Mr. Pocket Edition is asking, how did you convince them that your work is the best? You mean Fiat? I had my portfolio. And then they decided my portfolio was good enough to get, to be hired. And I was very happy, of course, to do PG in transportation design from Need or Meet College. So I need your opinion. So I'm fine art student from Kerala. All right. 
Next year, my course will be finished. I want to do uh, PG. What does it mean, PG? Program, I guess. Transportation design from need. In, in, at need, you can have a master. And also MIT College, it's a master. From fine art to master in car design, I don't see it very... I don't know. I wouldn't do it. But anyway. Okay, now let's make the second layer. Okay. And I'm going to make uh, the dark part darker. Because that's what we want. Uh, Post-graduation. Thank you, Sidar. Yeah, so it's a master program. Need, it's not bad. If you, if you want more car design, I think need NID, it's good. If you want to learn also clay modeling and stuff like that, computer, like making models, digital models, then uh, the MIT probably is better. Okay, those are always sketches, okay? Don't think that this is a, a rendering. This is not a rendering. It's a quick sketch. I could also imagine to make this one like that and just present this to my boss to say, you know, this is a volume search on a certain project. What do you think? You see? This is good enough for a, a quick presentation about uh, volume studies, for example. Okay. So, now, spray fix. Can you see that now it's still darker here, you see? Now you can really feel how it's turning the, the, the arch, the section of that top. And that's nice. All right. <clears throat> But you know what? I still want to make that darker because I want to make it really super shiny. Sir, I am an industrial design student from uh, ET. Okay, I want to do masters. So which university you recommend? Uh, Kaushik. Uh, you mean in India or in foreign countries? Explain yourself. Okay, so once again, let's hit again with the blue again now i'm making also my focal point because my focal point is going to be here in the center and i'm hitting with the blue without without using the powder okay because i really want to go strong Okay, can you see? It's even a little bit darker, not too much, but it got real dark in this area. So we have a nice smooth transition between dark light, dark light. Pocket, edition, everything. When you ask, if you ask this question, I get pissed, all right? I get really mad, okay? So don't even ask why, all right? Who's your brain? You will understand. Good. <laughs> Shine reflect. Yes, Ashim. Yes. So let me take look at the difference. This is the original color. Okay. Look what potential we have to make it still darker. You see. So now, now I think that I can, 
I can try to push that, uh, that contrast. And let's do it. Let's see what happens. Am I right or am I wrong? We'll see. I make some extra new dust of the color. Bravo, John, bravo. Mr. Pocket, listen, the wise man, John. Look what he wrote. Go, read, so you understand. Okay, so. Yeah, dark, dark. Okay, I think this is nice. Okay, so I think that this is enough, okay, enough. So I'll just put a little bit here and a little bit here. Okay, that's it. Now I stop with the blue. Next time I will go and buy a nice brush. I don't have any more mine. I had a very nice brush from school. I lost it. With all the changing homes and houses and apartments. Okay, let, let's wait that it dries. But look how shiny that thing is. Well, Mr. Pocket, if it's your passion, then don't worry about money. If you will be a good designer, you will make money because you will progress in your career. If you're gonna be a bad designer, you will not make money because you will not progress. Otherwise, as my father always told me, no matter what, if you do with engagement and honesty, your work with passion and you work hard, not tomorrow, not next month or next year, but someday, you will be always well repaid, so don't worry. All right, so, nice, nice. So, what I want to do now? Now we need to do something else. Now we need to add a little bit of black. No, black, no, yes, we need a little bit of black. Mixed with the blue. We mix, I mix them, eh? I don't put just the black. I mix the black with the blue, okay? I'm mixing right now. Just a little bit. Okay, I did it, now it's here. And let's do it. So we put also a little bit of the black. And now you can see that uh, has really a different type of feeling, you know? <clears throat> and now it's the time that we want to make some really shiny, effect so i would say that the warm light will put it here okay and the cool light will put it in the back it's like the sun is in this area almost coming down okay and here we have already the sky with the moon coming up 
So when we mix those two things, which is the reality, we will have this car that will be turning, all right? I'm going to wash my hands, which is just here. <laughs> Don't move. that we have the sun. I like contrast, so I'm, I exaggerate a little bit. So, can you see? Now, can you have, do you have the feeling, you know, psychologically, the feeling that the sun is coming down <coughs> somewhere far, no? Wait, I'll put it better so that you can see. And uh, now let's spray fix this. Let's wait that it's drying. <clears throat> and this time, let's use this uh, very light green, okay, to make the, the cool light on the other side. You see okay, how much we can play with the, with colors. Today we used a lot of colors. Just a little bit there, just a little bit. Then of course we can do something a little bit more artistic, you know, we can, uh, we can take uh, the green and we can do something like, uh, like this, wait, wait, let's do it right. You see, I give a, f a feeling of a, a light source here. And the, it is this light source is reflecting here. Then, because this is very light, I can take the real chalk, okay, the real pastel, and I just can hit a little bit here, you see? Then I can go with my finger. Okay. So that you can see that there is something happening there. Okay. Now it's not finished because we're missing something very important. 
and I'm going to show you. Because we, what we are missing now is some, a little bit of line work. It's very important to make sure that we can uh, consider our sketch finished. Of course, we need to use uh, a very good line work. And because this is a photocopy, what I will do, I'll go back. Uh, I will take my Faber-Castell classical blue pencil. Okay, the one I like a lot. Okay. Okay. Then I will take uh, also, where is it? Yeah, there you go, the green color. We have it here. Okay, so let's go and hit a little bit more some of the, uh, the, the area, especially around, you know, around the focal point. So, First of all, I need uh, to make my point, to sharp my point. So, I have a mess of, <laughs> of stuff on my desk. Okay, so let's, uh, there we go. Okay. So now that I have my, my nice sharp point, let's do it. You see, it's changing completely the feeling. And I am even making a correction <laughs> on the sketch that looks even better now. So here the, it, it is our reflecting, reflecting area on the glass. And of course here we're gonna do something really nice, which is See the contrast. The contrast it's it's helping a lot to have a nice feeling of this uh, of this car. Now let's make here read really a dark spot, and I will explain to you why I'm doing it here. Well, the reason is very simple because this area, which is very dark. To make sure that we have a really nice reflection has to be as dark as the darkest spot of the reflection. That's a theory of reflections rule. So that's why I make it really dark there. Okay, and here also a little bit, a little bit lighter here. I'm not exaggerating there. I just want to make it alive a little bit more, okay? I create an, an effect of shading dark light, dark on the left, lighter on the right, okay? It's going to give a very nice uh, effect of uh, dynamic composition.
Okay, as I told you, this is a sketch, okay? This is not a rendering. All right, so now I have my green, okay? And I put a little bit of green, just a little. I want to feel that green, even if I don't really see it. I just want to see it a little bit because that green is all the reflection of the top. You see? And then I can take, of course, a nice orange. Is this one? No, it's not this one. I was gonna make a mistake. Yeah, that one is salmon. So I take this one, okay. Okay, just few lines, not, not very much. And now we just add a little bit of uh, highlights and our and our sketch it's done okay now because this is this type of perspective the highlights is going to be a little bit like this this way okay follow me this type of uh, axe right so let's do it first one Always elliptical shape, okay? Second, third. Now, when I put the white like that, what does he do? He mixes with the, with the green a little bit. And that's not nice. Okay, so another one here, here, here. Okay, stop, unless it's gonna be too much. I wash my I wash my brush. So, what do you think? That's it. We went through all this. Okay. Well, Thank you very much for everybody. Thank you to you for being with me. You were 25 for more than an hour and a half, almost an hour and a half. So it's very nice. Next time uh, it's going to be, I think, uh, not on the 24th, okay? Because it's going to be holiday. But if you agree, we will be having our design talk before Christmas on Sunday, okay? So next week, we will be here the same time, but on Sunday, the 23rd of December. It will be also an opportunity to say goodbye, have a nice holidays to you and with your families, okay? So Sunday, 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 don't forget. Thank you, ciao, thanks John. Bye-bye.